So far, I have offers from Minnesota, Montana State, UTEP, and Nevada. Well, uh, transfer information to Weatherford. You know, I got caught up with UIL and the transfer rules, and so I wasn't able to play my sophomore year on varsity. But down there on JV, you know, I really uh, kind of had to think about it, think about what I was doing, and um, was able to kind of regroup and kind of get back to the basics of football. And I think that's something I really needed to do, is being thrown into a varsity field my freshman year after being in eighth grade. So, I mean, I feel like getting down to that JV level, regrouping, and getting myself together. is someone who takes things into their own hands whenever things are going bad they're the guy that's going to step up and kind of change the tide they're going to make a, everyone around them do better get their best out of them and that's hopefully someone that i can be for my team next year off the field being a leader you know probably the best thing is uh telling you guys to do the right thing it's really hard you know for a bunch of uh, teenagers to go out you know on summer vacation they can get caught up in a lot of trouble so being a leader off the field keeping them out of trouble you know telling them to do the right thing preaching to them you know sharing with them the gospel is a really big part of being a leader God has been a big part of my life, not only in my personal life, but in my athletic life, you know. Uh, there's a lot of things that I've been through that I've always looked on Him to help me, uh, you know, overcome certain situations. Uh, he's helped me through so many things, and uh, I give all the glory to Him. Under the radar sports media, the hottest sports videos in the nation. Turn up, man!